So, what's what's in the bill? What's not in the bill? There's been some spirited debate uh, about uh, about this bill, and I want to be clear uh, what's not in the bill. And I can give you specific section numbers and page numbers, and you can look for yourself. It's not a government takeover. We talked about that. Uh, there's specific language that said if you are not here legally in this country, you are not eligible for coverage, and there are requirements for specific documentation you have to show to prove your citizenship that you're here legally. Uh, there is no federal funding for abortions, and that language is clear, and there's discussion about how to make it clear, uh, but uh, it upholds the current law of the land. The current federal law says no federal dollars can be used for abortions. Uh, it strengthens, uh, there would be no uh, uh, cuts uh, that, that uh, hurt seniors and hurt Medicare. I'm sure Steve will talk about that. There's no death panels. Uh, what's in the bill and some of the uh, egregious insurance practices that we've talked about addresses tort reform in a couple of different ways, uh, addresses the sale of insurance across state lines, uh, and something that we've got young adult children. And uh, in this economy, especially when kids are trying to start a career and may not have uh, coverage through their employer, they would be able to stay on your coverage until their 27th birthday. And that would happen immediately. Um, these are some groups that are supporting the bill. Um, a couple of them are here today, and they can speak about why, uh, why they support the bill. There are a couple of nonpartisan websites that, uh, again, as you get chain emails, a lot of them get sent to me and people I represent saying, Mark, how can such and such be included in this bill? And they actually cite a page number, a section number, and with some, and, and an interpretation that's exactly not correct, you can go to these websites and uh, look for yourself. Uh, you can, Go to my website, shower.house.gov. There's a link right there where you can click to all of this information, probably more than, uh, than what you can actually read. This is the bill. Uh, double, double sided. Uh, it took me about a week to read it. Uh, I have constituents all the time who say, You didn't read that bill. Well, I'm an early riser. Every morning, every night, uh, I don't have much of a life in Washington. <laughs> My wife is in Michigan, so uh, I can show you all the dog-eared pages and the, uh, uh, the, the red and blue and pink. But you can read the bill yourself. The, the easiest way to do it is pull up the section-by-section -section analysis uh, that goes through each of the sections of the bill, and then you can kind of track and read the specific language. We have fact sheets and various information. 